Hallo Freundinnen der analogen Unterhaltung, da sind wir wieder und weiter geht's mit dem Stream mit neuen Gästen und zwar The Sillas Games. Hallo. The Sillas Games äh, mit mehreren Sachen. Das erste, was wir uns anschauen wollten, ist Sultans of Wind, Master, the Master of the Cloud. Master, Master of the, of the Cloud. Ja, yeah, so, a very uh, interesting looking game. Thank you very much. Um, uh, about so wind. About wind, clouds and um, carpet riders. So basically this is uh, Albisat, the magical city of mm -hmm. uh, magic carpet riders, uh, where we will play the riders, which will have to guide our whole crew through this maze uh, of uh, clouds to the opposing palace. Mm -hmm. And the first team to do so will win the game. So first of all, the cool thing is this really uh, interesting and uh, unique uh, modular board that has a ton of layers. Uh, and uh, in the middle of the board, we will find these tiles that uh, uh, will have the clouds, which are some of the uh, places that our pawns cannot pass through. Mm -hmm. And uh, we, during the game, we will get a chance to move uh, these modular parts. So that by the, the wind is changing. Exactly. exactly. So uh, by switching them or rotating mm -hmm. them on their mm -hmm. uh, axis. try to make a path. Exactly. Mm -hmm. or uh, most of the times, uh, also uh, trap other yeah, of uh, other players. Which I will is, always trap hunter. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, we're <laughs> very good athletes, and we don't uh, want to have uh, some beef with the other teams. Of course, of course, of course. So we do this by uh, each round. Uh, uh, we have this wind channel here, mm -hmm. and in its turn, we will choose two of the tiles which will be hidden be behind the screen. So each player will have his wind channel, which will be split into two, with a hidden part and a visible part. Mm -hmm. So in each turn, we will choose two of the tiles, play them, and then feed them back to the wind channel. Ah, and, and by doing this, yeah, yes, there's a coming. small slot that they will go through. Okay. So we cycle our actions each turn. So the people know, okay, these four are so here. So you have a rough, no. a rough understanding of what the other uh, players might play, but you're not 100% sure what they're going to play each turn. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, uh, because of these numbers here, uh, the, the initiative order for each turn will change. So we choose two, we sum the two tiles, and the highest player will go first, and the second one, the third one, and the Okay, one. so this style has a different number. Exactly, so each style is unique. Mm -hmm. And we have to strategize and program our uh, turn each, uh, for each phase because when we have played one of the actions, it's going to be available again in three turns. Okay, yeah, okay. Okay, so for, with these tiles, we can either move our pawns, we can, as I said before, switch or rotate uh, the, the cloud tiles, but we can also try to catch the gin pawn okay, by moving it around. Gen, yeah. So this is the gin, and if we get to it's a nice catch gen it, or evil gin? He uh, help all us gins, or all he... gins are good, but okay. we have to catch it first. Yeah, okay. So once we catch it, it will grant us a wish, and the wish is to play one extra uh, one extra uh, yes, one extra move. Mm -hmm. So this is really important because we will cycle our moves much faster, and we will get. So with go. the help, help of the chin, exactly, we will exactly. reach our goal faster. Exactly. So let's recap uh, real quick. We have a pirate um, uh, magic carpet crew that we have to guide through this maze of changing tiles, cloud tiles. Mm -hmm. And we do this by choosing two of our hidden movement tiles, which will be cycled and fed through our wind channel. And New ones will enter each turn. Ja. Also für alle, die irgendwie schlecht oder wenig Englisch sprechen, eine ganz kurze Zusammenfassung. Wir sind natürlich, ja, wir reiten auf fliegenden Teppichen äh, und müssen uns hier durch so ein Labyrinth aus, aus Wolken, die uns den Weg blockieren und natürlich die anderen Spieler uns den Weg quasi bahnen. Und das machen wir, indem wir diese Wolkenplättchen drehen oder verschieben können. Und unsere Aktionen wählen wir aus, indem wir hier immer von den versteckten Teilen können wir hier zwei auswählen und so ein ganz netter Mechanismus, weil die schiebst dann hier immer rein. Das heißt, ich sehe also, welche Plättchen sind gerade nicht bei ihm unter dem Sichtschirm, kann er also nicht verwenden, welche kommen da als nächstes. Also Hidden Information. Uh, Semi-programming. And uh, it's really easy to pick up and uh, play, but it has a ton of uh, strategic thinking and layers of strategy. So it's equally uh, interesting for uh, younger audiences or even adults that are looking for a strategy game. Mm -hmm. And coupled with a really uh, unique uh, art style of the game, yeah. 
and the components. It's, uh, it's, really cool. it's an instant cl uh, classic, yeah. I think. Hatten wir nämlich noch gar nicht gesagt. Es ist für zwei bis vier Spieler. Ab acht Jahren wird es empfohlen. Also eignet sich tatsächlich als Familienspiel und dauert so 30 bis 45 Minuten. Uh, wir gucken mal, wir Fragen aus dem Chat haben. Some questions. What's the price? The price will be around uh, 35. Uh, 35, 35 Euro. Und die Silas Games, wo findet man euch? What, which booth? Number or the hall? We are hall six, booth D one hundred and six. Halle uh, six, D one hundred six. Come and play Sultans of Wind and all our other games. So, yeah, because you have some other games. Yes, uh, yes, we have some other games. We have an well. Emojito. No, express the feeling. Emojito. Emojito, so, of course, yes, yes. of course. Yeah. Everybody knows emojis. Yes. Everybody uses emojis. Yes. But now we will uh, be introduced to Emojito, which mm -hmm. is our new party game. We're, we have to express the feeling. Okay. So the, uh, here we have 100 different uh, emotion cards. As we can see here, each one is unique and uh, each one is really um, thought out because uh, we had a huge uh, emotional matrix that we, we have based it on. And each one has slight details that will help the player that is trying to describe the card to the other, uh, to the other players with uh, with small slight details so there's a ton of different ways to play the game but uh, the, uh, the, uh, the basic game is uh, a co-op okay so uh, all the players will play against the the game and uh, it's really simple the active player will just draw a card he will look at the card and he will have to describe uh, the expression uh, the, the feeling on the card using only his face, sounds or both, depending on when, where you are on the board. Okay. Okay. Ah, okay. I see sounds, yes, faces, exactly. faces and sound. Faces and sounds. So okay. Uh, make, make an example. Yes, of course. That, uh, that's where we're here. So, okay. I draw a card. Totale bitte wieder. Schaltest du oben dann? Okay. So, I draw the card, I look at the card, I try to understand the, uh, the feeling behind it and then uh, I have to uh, describe it using only my face, okay? So I will go like... Like, um, mad angry. So, now what we do? <laughs> we draw six more cards. One, two, three. One, ah, two, okay, three. of course. So, for a total of seven, which are also the spaces around the board. Yeah, okay, I get it. We shuffle yeah. them, and then we put them in a random order in each space. And I'll have now to decide Yes. Okay. The, Each player will have this guessing dial. I think there are two possible faces. Okay. No, Which no, one? okay. Which one? one? I think... No, th this is the better part. Okay. I, 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 I'll explain <laughs> the rest later. <laughs> Maybe you are... Was the bird? Are you sure? No, I'm not really sure. Okay. Or the carrot. <laughs> the pepper. The pepper. Yes, Sorry. the pepper. The chili pepper. The chili pepper. So, Red hot chili pepper. Yes, exactly. Which one is it? I, I think it's a bird. Yes. yes, I was a bird. Awesome. Yes. I was You're a good perfect. Yeah. Thank you, thank You've you. You've got some so, training. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. I've, I've played it a couple of times. <laughs> so here, uh, so the guessers, the other players, mm -hmm. will have to vote using this guessing dial, okay, which then. they rotate. Yeah. Then, uh, for each correct answer, we move oh, okay. around the board. For each incorrect one, the game pawn, the, uh, the opponent, will move around the board. And each time a pawn passes through the checkered line, we, we win one card as a trophy. Okay, that's points at the yes, end. Exactly. Yeah. It's really fun. Okay. Yes. I like it. It's a cool There's, party game. Yes, so you yes. can play it at uh, night when the people are can come on. You exactly. Got... And there's a lot of variations to the game, uh, which uh, makes it even more interesting, mm -hmm. it, uh, makes it more silly or even much more challenging as well. And it's really cute uh, artwork. It's thank you, thank you. Very like much. a shark here. Uh, I, I showed it before. I have the high seen and so it's really schöne and ganz viele halt. How many different parts? 100, 100, yes. 100 cards. So each one is unique. Alles mit. Kannst du noch mal kurz auf die DJ Kamera? So hier man sieht wirklich Haufen Emotions. Okay, uh, look like this. <laughs> Sehr cool. Okay, totale bitte. Um, great. Uh, it's also ready. It can bought at your. Yes, yes, of uh, course. The price you can find of us again. Hall six D one one hundred six. Halle six. Nochmal D one hundred six. De Silas Games and the price from Emojito. Twenty. Twenty. Twenty bucks. Euros. Euros. Yes. <laughs> so and, and lastly, I see one really quickly. Last yes, game. we have Abla Abla. Abla Abla. So this is uh, a game where 
you have to twist your tongue and tangle your words. So okay. it's a party game, a word party game, yeah. that we have this game board, we have King Abla and Queen uh, Abla uh, and Ubla. King uh, Ubla King. and Queen Abla, King, yeah. uh, which are these uh, furry little creatures, <laughs> where uh, they have lost the proper way to communicate with each other, and this is where we come in. Okay. So there are category cards. Each category card will have a theme, like an actor, for example, and five slots. So it has a semi-legacy uh, mechanism as well. Okay. So in each turn, uh, after we, we split into two teams, we will uh, one of the play players will draw a category card. Write down in secret something that has to do with the Okay, uh, he can choose by his own. I can make you yeah, Arnold yeah. Schwarzenegger. But the thing is that we have this spinner ah. where we spin and there's two possibilities. If it goes on a question mark, mm -hmm. then we have to describe using a challenge card. So this one says, for example, poke out your tongue while you're talking. So I have to describe <laughs> everything with my tongue outside my mouth, for example. Yeah. There are uh, even some hard ones, like using only adjectives and so forth and so forth. Uh, but if we go, for example, to, uh, to a letter, mm -hmm. then we have a letter challenge. The letter challenge is basically what? Uh, we have to describe using words only that start with this letter, <laughs> or we can substitute or add this letter to any word. Okay. The first letter we can substitute. Okay. And, and what's the legacy? So, and, and, and the next? Next the next game, player, the next, next player. Uh, the next player that might draw for on the next game or yeah. in the, se in the same uh, game, cannot write what already has been written, cannot use the the same word. So and uh, you must find a new actor. Find, yes, yes. And we have chosen to do this because uh, we have seen through party games that when you play it with the same uh, friends, uh, it gets it gets a bit stalled uh, after some yeah. uh, some games. True. Yeah. Okay. We have to hurry up. Okay. I, okay. I heard. <laughs> but uh, it's too cool. <laughs> yes, this is a party game for 4 to 12 players, so a lot of people can uh, play this. And uh, when we're finished, we can either erase everything, it has a special coding on it, ah, okay. but we can also keep it as it is. So and my you've got Abla a real Abla, legacy yes, game. Exactly. Like be totally different from your uh, Abla Abla. Yeah, also wirklich ein party watch spiel auch ganz, ganz witzig mit einem besonderen Gag, das hier eben auf den Karten noch gar nicht draufsteht. Hier ist jetzt zum Beispiel ein Schauspieler, den würde ich dann zuerst mal einen draufschreiben, aber das Schwierige ist, es kann dann auch noch wirklich Probleme dabei geben, dass ich noch irgendeine Anforderung erfüllen muss, während ich dann diesen Schauspieler, der dann eben vielleicht auch noch hier mit einem bestimmten Buchstaben und sowas anfängt, als uh, Trouble and Crazy Party Game. So, Really cool. Twist your tongue and tangle your words. Yeah, that's good for me. <laughs> <laughs> Abla Ubla, Emojito, and Sultans of Wind. And many, many other games. And many, many other games. And many, many other games. Hall 6 D106. Halle 6 D106. So cool that you come by to our booth. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very, very much. Wir machen gleich weiter. Ganz, ganz kurze Pause hier und dann geht's mit dem nächsten Gast weiter. Like us on Facebook uh, as well. The Silas International, the Silas Games International. We have cool. Uh, like uh, giveaways with uh, the new games. Oh, awesome, we will check it out. See you. Thank you.